Hello everyone, Meerkat's back and today I've got another mod showcase for you called the Shapeshifter mod as you can see here, Shapeshifter mod, mod showcase, second mod showcase by Meerkat or mod showcases with Meerkat, as I just thought of them something like that anyway and there's three crafting recipes first thing is called the Shapeshifting Bone which is two iron ingots, two glowstone dust, a rotten flesh and four bones and you get Shapeshifting Bone the second one is the shapeshifting ability bone, which is just the shapeshifting bone and the blaze rod. <coughs> Sorry about that. And the next one, the original shapeshifting rod, is quite a dear one, but makes shapeshifting a lot easier. Six diamonds, two gold ingots, and the original shapeshifting bone. I'll show you what all these do now. This is only going to be a quick mod showcase, because it's a handy little mod, but it's still quite good. As you can see, at the bottom there, I've got my own little guy get, like guy, which looks like that basically. And when you got this one installed, it gives you the Mojang cape. Um, since I don't even have a cape, if you had, let's say, a Minecon cape, you wouldn't be able to get the Minecon cape back with this mod. You'll always have this um, this Mojang cape on. And what you can basically do with it, this bone lets you turn into any random mob just by right clicking. And as a gas, you can double jump and it lets you fly. Oh no, let's just show you that in survival. Just look, I'm in survival now. So I can jump in. The gas can sprint as well. And when you double jump, it lets you fly. And yeah, that's that one. Spider can climb walls and stuff. Eep. And so on, like, you can turn to all of them. Squid, 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 dirt, squid. Anyway, right. So that's that boom, really. Let's just go back to player, if you can. Oh, I'm on fire. Because it's a zombie. Oh, that would be Ooh, this is probably my favourite one. I'll show you it later. Oh, slime. Anyway, this one lets you pick whatever you want, innit? So I'm just going to start being a player again. And it's actually pick them all. And this one lets you have special abilities. When you're playing as a player, your special ability is to turn into Herobrine. But you still got the cape and you got super strength. Um, watch this. Let's just get some pig men. Oh, see? Pigmen are quite hard, aren't they? Watch this. Four punch kill. That's with a punch. Because you got super strength. This bone can be used a thousand times before you have to craft a new one, and now I'm back to normal. Hey Brian, normal. Hey Brian, normal. I don't like the way I've got my eyes the wrong way around because I put the black dot on the outside of the eye instead of the inside, so it looks like I've got hair Brian eyes, and I really didn't want it, but you know. The next one I'm going to show you is the bat, which can jump, when you double tap, you can fly like you're creative, and the ability is to turn to vampire mode. But I actually don't know what vampire mode does, it just makes your eyes go red, as you can see. Normal white eyes, if you can just see that. And then red eyes, but I don't know what it does. And basically, when, let's say you just get some of them, you automatically go upside down. Let's just put that there. You automatically go upside down when you land underneath the block. As you can see, you can see it in the guy there that I'm upside down, and when you do that, upside down, then you click vampire mode on, you've got red eyes upside down. So, but I like the bat. And plus, because you're the same size as the mobs you get, when you're playing as things like this, you can get into small spaces. So, you could have like a door which only like, say, a chicken, silverfish, pig, bat, or something could get into. Next, I'm going to show you the chicken. Um, Oh yes, that's another thing. The bat's permanent got the bat's permanently got night vision, see? And in daytime. Oh, it's not happening. Sometimes there's a bug where everything goes black at daytime. But chicken, I can see now. And it's got slow falling, as you can see. Triple jump. So you can do a triple jump. So you can basically make yourself glide. So if I just build some steps or something. Like that, 
Down it's well, you could just spin jump up there, click it again, click it again and just glide away. That's the chicken and its special ability is to throw eggs. Yeah, eggs. Throw eggs at sheep. Egg on sheep. Anyway, that's the chicken. Next I'm going to show the creeper. Look like a creeper. Um, can split as a creeper, which is a bit weird. I don't know whether you can become supercharged or not. I actually don't know. But we're going to them. When you right click, you just explode where you're pointing. Just right until you look at the floor, and you could like explode. This mod, I think it said something like it only works on a server. Everyone in the server has got the mod on. Let's just get through this to get out. So only work. Oh yeah, and the blast doesn't hurt yet either. So this mod only works on a server if everyone in the server has got the mod on. There's me as creeper. Next, the end of man. Your free block, there's a little bug with this, but all the others you look like you're one block high, but this one, you look like you're two blocks high and really you're free because look you can't jump. And you're three blocks high like that. And the special ability is to teleport. The teleporting sometimes a bit buggy like it is now. I think that's a bug that they have to fix on a later update or something. But oops. It's a bit buggy. Next is the golem. You're an iron golem. And this is the same with the two block high thing when the three blocks high. But this guy, I don't like the way that it's got the same amount of health. But your special ability is to make other iron golems. And then when you punch something, it's when you're flying up to the air and you die four damage as well as the punch. So it's quite hard. No. You can see they've got the little arm animation. The audio animation, so anyone that looks a bit weird to the end of Dragon, which I can see. Um, there. So next, I'm going to show you a mushroom. You look like a mushroom, you've got mushrooms on. Your special ability is to just throw random mushrooms. Mm. So it's a bit pointless that ability, but no, no. Pig, quite small, you look like a pig, and the special ability is to throw cooked pork chops, it's going to shortage your food. Sheep, every time you click it, you can become a random colour. Like, look, now I'm a pink sheep, so if I want to think that was dead rare, oh, look, it's a pink sheep, it's dead rare. I can now split out pink wool everywhere. Yeah. Whatever colour sheep you are, you fire out that colour wool. But now I'm blue, blue won't. And sheep's one box high as well. Skeleton. The problem with the zombie and skeleton is, you can see the rod in your hands. That's the one problem. So that's when people know you're not, and you collect fire arrows. But they're a bit buggy, as you can see. And you got like, I don't know how much it is, but you got a chance to come with a skeleton like I am now. Even though wither skeletons don't even fire arrows, you still fire arrows. So well, let's go with snowman. This makes snow everywhere, but you go like an almost snow gold. And shape shifting ability bonus five to step off. Next is the squid, which don't do anything. What's its special ability? Ink sacks, I forgot about that one. But what I don't like it, even when you're in water, you just drag around like this, see tentacles don't move. That's like the, one of the only animations that don't really work. Next, I can squeeze the witch. And you see the rod in the hand as well, which is kind of annoying. But you just throw insta damage potions, which don't harm you. But they don't work in zombies and skeletons because you need healing potions to kill them, don't you? they like undead. Next is the wool. And this ability is quite cool. Super speed. Look at that. Then when I sprint it, Wee sprinting. Oh, I picked the product for that. Oh well. Next up for the wall is the blaze. Which when you double tap you can fly in the ability to throw fireballs which blow up and set fire. Like that. Next up for the blaze is the cow. Which special ability is to throw what? Throw B. Put B. State. Next, the Ender Dragon. When you double tap, you can fly. Um, like cruising around, Ender Dragon it out. Special about this, throw stronger fireballs than the blaze and the gas, basically. Boom. Burn down tree. Ah, oh, for a second. 10, 17. That's low, that. Anyway.
Whoa, 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 they hurt you as well. I've just realised that in the hell. So stay away from them. Next is the gas. When you double tap, they fly as well. And they fire fireballs. Which do around the same amount as a blaze, I'll say. Not a bit less than a blaze. But the energy dragon still does the most damage. Next, after the gas, there's the man view, probably my favourite. You get like a 33% chance, like a third chance of everything from a small one block I one. A medium two block car, you're a big one like I am. I like these because you actually do the animation like that, I can make myself look like a monkey. Following around, and your special ability is to put fire and your immune to fire and lava. This guy's probably my favourite because you can drag along for like, ah. Plus, you can make fire everywhere and punch people. And if you had a diamond sword out, it would do the right damage as that. But the fire's cool. Just set fire to them stairs. Ah. Set fire to the bat podium. Bat podium. <laughs> Next, ocelot. You have like a 50% chance to have become a cat or a natural ocelot, but I seem to always become a cat. See, I'm still a cat. Still a cat. Ocelot, there you go. A nice special ability. Uh, let's turn it over. Green. Oh. Their special ability is to make baby ocelots or cats, wherever you click. I want the rain turn on. There, set it, sunrise. Next is the player, which is showing you where you can turn this hair around and you got super strength. You killed a spider. One man. One of them is a spider. Come on, I'm gonna fight you, man. I'll, I'll pork chop spank you. Come on. And I don't think mobs harm you when you hair around, unless you punch you. Big picture. Okay, Next, silverfish, you're small, like super small. Then your ability is to make more silverfish, which don't attack you. Slime, the silverfish start attacking you, and you get to make more slimes. Make the slime army! Ah, slimes! Oh, I've got to go hair down on these silverfish. Ah, the slime's all attacking me. Ah, no! Why, Sam? Why? Um, please. Damn! I'm blown up by a slime. What the fuck? ADT, if I'm blown up by a slime, I don't need slime to blow people up. Come on, I'm getting attacked again. I'm really lagged out. You know what? Let's go crazy. Now we can kill these things, let's get some more rods. I keep accidentally putting them in there, let's get that one, that one. That's all we need. Right, let's go dead high up. Oh, we don't have to do one creative, let's blow all these bastards up. How long is this video already? I said it was only going to be a short one and it's already longer than my other mod review. Oh well, it's a cool mod, I like this mod. Let's just do the rest in creative. Next is the slime, spider, and you get a 50% chance to be a cave spider. And their ability is to make webs, and you can climb up walls. And you go through the webs like a normal spider would, just dead fast. Next is the spider, is a villager, and your special ability is to throw a random item. You can go up to diamond tool, see where I throw a diamond pickaxe. So you can just throw random things. Like, ah. Uh... Next up to the villager is the wither bar, which is for his wither skulls, like, what's that blue snap? No, it's blue one. Ah. Wither skulls. After the wither, the last one is the zombie. And what happens is, whatever you basically kill, oh, in daytime, so you're not burning, you turn to a zombie pigman, so that you don't burn. Basically, if I turn it on survival now, I'm not burning. I should be sitting on fire, but I'm not. So, basically, you've got to turn to, ah, no, 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 creator, creator, and so, let's give myself a diamond sword or something, and I'll show you what happens. Whatever you kill, basically turns into a zombie. So you can turn whatever you kill into more zombies. And then, that's this mod. I hope you like this mod review. Um, yeah. And now I'm about to land away. Vampire mode!
Delete blocky that. Uh, anyway, hope you like this mod review. I'm Maycat, and this was the shapeshifting mod. I'll put the link in the description. And goodbye. Maycat is now logging me down.